This piece is also uh, from the Renaissance, although it appeared in a manuscript, an Italian manuscript, in the uh, 19th century called Spagnoletta. Now it is, it was also used, Joaquin Rodrigo used this theme as a little part of his Fantasia para un gentil hombre, Gentleman's Fantasy, a great, a really famous um, classical guitar concerto for guitar and, uh, well, anyway, pretty cool piece. Uh, but what we're going to take a look at, this is very easy reading. It's all in first position. It's basically in the key of C or A minor, no sharps and flats. Just stays in first position, as I just mentioned. And uh, simple 3-4 time. You've heard it now, and now I just want you to take a look at the music. And before you even look at any more parts of this, see what you can get out of it. So this is again part of our classical, our reading music series. So hopefully you've gone through the guide to reading music, because we're not looking at, we're not using tab for any of this stuff. So just a basic uh, level two piece that I want people to tackle after you've gone through volume one of the reading music. So coming up, we'll talk about it a little bit more specifically, but uh, and we'll kind of break it down measure by measure. But you've heard it, you've seen it. See what you can do before you go any further into this lesson. That was the first segment I put together on a lesson, very short Renaissance piece. Uh, written for the lute, of course, back uh, through four, 500 years ago, maybe more, 600 years ago, and um, a part of our classical guitar series at Totally Guitars, and most, more importantly, part of our reading series. These pieces I don't put up in tablature, they just have real notes in them. And so there's a, our, our Learn to Read course called The Guide to Reading Music is something that many of our students are going through, and this is a supplemental piece in trying to get that down. So if you'd like to check it out, it's part of the Target program at Totally Guitars, which is our monthly subscription program. There are also a lot of free lessons there. There's a whole free beginner's course that gets you started on all this kind of stuff. But uh, with this lesson, it's part of our uh, learning to read and, and it, you know, kind of progress as a, as a musician in lots of different, different areas. So but loading it up with some more uh, classical and Renaissance and Baroque stuff in the interest of uh, branching out a bit. So if you'd like to check out the lesson on Spagnoletta. Come visit us at Totally Guitars.